Hi Wendase and welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Pila and please do not forget to subscribe and also switch on your post notifications so that you'll get a notification whenever I upload a new video. Anyways guys, today is day one of Vlogmas. I'm so excited guys. It's the first time I'm doing Vlogmas and I am so excited. I know it's going to be a lot of work but Whenever I do something new, I get so excited because it challenges me. New things always um, come with challenges and I actually like challenges because it actually makes me step out of my comfort zone. So yeah, and I hope you guys will enjoy this video and please do show me some love and drop me a heart in the comment section. Enjoy! I like starting my morning with journaling so um, I would normally have my Bible and also my journal so that I can just basically command my morning and um, basically write what I want for that particular day and just start my day with a good spirit so here I was just basically journaling so I write the date of, um, of the day and then I would write whatever is in my heart at that time what I'm grateful for this helps me a lot it basically sets the tone for the whole day um, and then I would look for something to watch on YouTube either I would look for affirmations or I would look for sermons or look for songs that will be inspirational for that day just to make sure that I'm in, in, in a good good mood for the morning and read, read scripture and as I said watch uh, sermon here I was watching Transformation Church I love Transformation Church a lot so this is what I wore. I basically wore a dress and a hat. Ding! I'm sure you guys know that from TikTok. Anyway, so that is my lunch, guys. I wasn't having much of an appetite. You know, when I'm busy, I really don't want to eat. But I decided, you know what? Let me have something to eat. So I had strawberries, a boiled egg, and a pear. I was also prepping my vlogmas stuff for my YouTube channel. I had to change the YouTube cover. Then I went to sit outside just to get a bit of fresh air and start editing. And then I remember the woods, you got in December, we need to have Ifrandal. And then um, it was time for me to go and wash my hair and basically check the state of all my wigs because the big days galog ikel kufanile ugut ibe hot. So here I was just basically separating my wigs. I put the straight ones on one side and also put the curly ones on the other side. For my curly hair, I used the Dove Pure Care Dry Oil Shampoo. So for my straight hair, I used Dove Oxygen Moisture Shampoo. I don't use the same shampoo for curly hair and also for my um, straight wigs. I always use different shampoos because they basically need different things like curly hair needs more moisture as compared to the straight hair. 
and then um, I washed the wigs. I started with the straight ones. This one was the first time I was washing it. It's one of my newer wigs. As you can see, it still has lace at the back. Um, they told me it was black, but definitely they dyed this wig. I then used conditioner. The conditioner that I used, it's the Pantene 3 Minutes Miracle. Um, I saw this at clicks and it was very, very reasonable. I was like, hmm, let me give it a try because I've been seeing people um, speaking nice things about Pantene. So I decided to give it a try. And oh my goodness, the way my curly hair loved this conditioner. I know curly hair loves conditioner in general, but this particular one, damn, my hair really, really came alive after I applied this conditioner. So um, when I put conditioner on the hair, it also gives me a bit of time to detangle. So here I was brushing the hair with the detangling brush so just to make sure that um, I detangle it. And then I was basically checking my wigs as well. This one, the I don't know what to call this thing. It was old, so I had to cut it out so that it is of like an inch. I started with my curly hair so that I can give it enough time to deep condition. Um, after finishing all my curly wigs, I then went on, left them with the conditioner, and then I went on to put conditioner on my straight wigs. The straight wigs also enjoyed this conditioner. Um, I could just see a difference instantly. They all came alive. I thought the sun was straight, but I saw a bit, a bit of curls when I was applying this conditioner. And um, as you can see here, my closure wasn't looking so good. But anyways, I was using a Denman brush for my straight hair just to make sure that I have thoroughly um, detangled it. They were not tangled as such, but just to make sure that I properly comb them out and look at the closure, it was then looking so good. When I finished washing all my hair, then it was time for me to put a leave-in conditioner. I was just basically inspecting them just to check. You know, and I was so happy guys. I love curly hair. And whenever I see my curly wigs looking to die for, I get so excited. Even my straight hair, uh, my straight wigs were looking so divine. So I was really, really happy because it took me a long time, but it was actually worth it. As you can see, all my wigs were looking a pashasha, you know.